Hey guys, what's up? So today's video is a really exciting video because, um, I got PR. This is a really exciting video because I actually was indeed added to the Orly PR list. They, I sent them an email, I was like, Hey, love your polishes, love your brand, how's it going? And, and they were like, hey! <laughs> so they added me to the PR list. I am just over the moon. This is the first brand that I am on the PR list for. And they did go ahead and send me their Winter 2022 Futurisms collection. Now the back of the box describes this collection and it says, Welcome to Futurism, a celebration of dynamic energy, of forward momentum, six shimmering steel tone hues evoke dynamism, and, and of the dynamism of urban landscapes with the frosted blue hues greens and purples to pave your attention. Embrace the fluidity and continuous progress during your stay in the industrial playground. I know I stuttered over my words a little bit. If you actually don't know this, I wear hearing aids. And I have a little bit of a speech impediment. So sometimes I trip over myself. Sorry about it. So I do want to go ahead and get into the brand Orly a little bit themselves. They actually were the brand that created the French manicure, which is mind-blowing um, that they did that. That was so revolutionary. They are a mainstream salon nail polish brand that is made in the USA. They are 12 free and they do come in these very generous 18 milliliter size bottles. Most brands come literally anywhere between like 10 and 14 milliliters. So Orly is really giving you your money's worth when you buy from them. I have always really enjoyed that about them. I know when I order from Orly, they are going to be giving me my money's worth. And we will get into pricing and availability after the swatches, but let's go ahead and check out the swatch footage. All right, and as with last time, I am starting off with Hala Taco Peely Base. First off, we have the shade Dynamism. I don't know how to say this word, I'm sorry. But it is a steel toned, pink inspired shade. I really like this color. Next up, we have the shade Urban Landscape. As I always say with greens in collection, this again is my husband's favorite shade. I do really love this steel-toned green shade. And I am also using the Orly Polish Shield Top Coat. Next up, we have the shade Ascension. I love this color. Again, I always say I love blues. This is no different, no exception. This steel-toned blue shade is really beautiful. Next up, we have Forward Momentum. This is a purpley, pink-ish mix between the two steel-toned shade. I really like this color. It's really unique. Next up, we have the shade Industrial Playground, and this is like a purpley blue-ish, steel-toned inspired shade. This is really beautiful. I actually wore this a few days after filming this swatch. And last, but certainly not least, we have the shade Fluidity. This is my favorite shade in this collection. This is just straight up silver, sparkly silver, foils, scattered holographic in there. This is such a beautiful color. I love it. So yeah, there you have it. That was the Orly Futurism collection. Their collection for winter 2022. Now, this collection is available on their website. I will go ahead and link the collection set down below as well as the Orly website if you want to just shop around and pick a few different colors. The box set is available for $63 and then if you wanted to just maybe cherry pick and pick out a couple of shades, each individual shade is available for $10.50 on the Orly Beauty website. Again, it will be listed listed down in the description box below with pricing, etc., everything like that. I am just so over the moon to have this opportunity to be on Orly's PR list. Thank you so much to Orly. You guys have really, like, made my reinsurgence of content creating and stuff like that really worth it. I wasn't in it for PR, but the fact that it has gotten to this point, I am so just elated that I can exchange my services for PR. <laughs> 
I know that sounds weird. It might sound a little, like, mundane and, like, full of myself, but, like, this is exciting. I quit doing YouTube for, like, two years, three years consistently, and with my Instagram and my nail hobby, I'm getting back into creating content, and it's really showing me that it's worth it. So I'm actually really grateful to be on the early PR list, and I can't wait to review more future launches for them. All right, guys, so if you guys did like this video, go ahead and make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe for more from me, and make sure you turn that bell notification to all, so that way you get any time I upload a video. Alright, bye guys! <laughs>